guys, what's up? Welcome back to another day, another adventure. I'm Dev, these are my adventures, and I'm a flight attendant for a US domestic carrier. I am on my way to the airport because for the first time in three days, we are working. We're doing a three day trip, and I feel like I haven't done a flight attendant vlog in a few weeks now. I've done weekend in my life. I did my St. Augustine vlog. Yeah, I feel like it's been a while. A high hour three day trip, almost 18 hours. We have three legs today. We do a Milwaukee turn, and then we do a leg to Providence. I'm basically off tomorrow, all day in Providence. We have a 28 hour layover. And then on the last day, we do a leg home to Orlando, and then we do a Buffalo turn out of Orlando. It's gonna be a pretty busy day. Don't know how much I'm gonna be able to vlog today. I am the E flight attendant. Me and the D will be traveling solely on this epic adventure. Jomar chilling. I have my dinner over here. Our plane is under maintenance, so we're waiting for a plane to come in from Harrisburg. So now we're not even getting to Providence until 2 a.m. This has been the longest day. So we've made it to Providence. You guys have seen this room before. I'll show you again because I love it so much. Welcome to Providence. I am just sitting in my hotel room, drinking my coffee. I guess it's not good morning because it's like noon. I love Starbucks. Okay, we did three legs yesterday, right? We did Milwaukee or Orlando to Milwaukee. Milwaukee, Orlando, just a turn. When we landed, we looked at our phones and we had noticed that there was a tail swap. So me and the guy I'm working with, my he was really confused. He's like, what are we doing? I'm like, they're tail swapping us. That's what it says. And he's like, yeah, I see that. That's so weird because over the PA, um, the main foot, the head flight attendant said, this is a RON. And when it's a RON, the aircraft remains overnight, R-O-N, RON, which means cleaners will come on, they'll clean it, they'll cater it, and it sleeps at the gate. And we were really confused because we still had one leg to Providence, right? My friend Jomar, as you guys saw, is the gate agent. So I'm like, hey, what's up? And he goes, oh, they tail swapped your aircraft because it was under maintenance. Okay. I mean, the plane's going to sleep anyway, so might as well fix it. And then he's like, then they tail swapped you again because your second plane is under maintenance. And it's like an engine thing. I was like, okay. So he's like, they, they swapped you into a third aircraft and it's coming from Harrisburg, so that's why you guys are delayed. And people are super angry at us. We don't know really like what's going on. But like, can I have the number for uh, guest relations, customer service? I'm like, sure. You can complain all you want, which is fine, but they're trying to get you to your destination as fast as possible. We don't like the delays just as much as you don't because we're not getting paid. We ended up getting here at 1 a.m. By the time we got to the plane and to the hotel and all of that, it was 2 a.m. So I slept until 11 because that's eight hours. And now it's like 12 something and 
I have my breakfast right here. So I have a banana. I have, they, are, they have a Keurig in this room and I love this hotel for that reason. I'm having hot coffee and enjoying my grounds. But I'm just gonna sit back, enjoy my breakfast, get ready and go across the street to the mall and go walk around, get some steps in. It's 50 degrees outside, so I'm not thrilled about that, but I really don't have any plans today. I'm off the whole day. Who is watching The Bachelor this season? I am just so curious. Like, I have literally been watching this show since I was like 10, and I feel like the girls just keep getting worse and worse. Like, I don't know if it's because all these girls are like my age now or like, did I just not realize it before? But, like, I follow people on Twitter. And what's her name? Victoria just said that she ate, like, lunch in the bathroom every day. Like, okay, Katie Heron for Mean Girls. And then she's in, like, beauty pageants and all this stuff in her yearbook photos that someone in the Bachelor Nation had posted. Like, I just don't get it. Like, did you eat back in the bathroom every day and do pageants? Like, you kicked Aaliyah off the show, basically. And because you said she put on a fake persona. But maybe you put on a fake persona. I don't know. That's my rant. Um, I'm just finishing up my hair. I think I'm going to go across the street once I eat lunch. Um, I plugged in my hot logic. I have soup in there. It's a big potato. Yum. But I'm testing out this new curling iron. It's one of those where you can like take this top part off and there's five different things you can put on it, sizes. But this is the biggest size. This is an inch and a half. And I like the way that it um, curled my hair. I think it looks really nice. And it gets really hot. There's two settings on it. There's zero, one, and two. And I had it on two the other day and my hair smelled so burned. I like it, you guys should check it out if you're in the mood for a new curling iron. Um, I'm going to eat lunch, finish watching The Bachelor, and then I think I'm having beer tonight across the street at the mall with my friend Kristen, who actually lives here and I've been in contact with her and she said that she wants to show up. So we'll see, we'll see if we're having beer at B-dubs with uh, Kristen from my dance days. I'm officially ready and all I have is the leggings and vans and a sweater. So we're gonna run across the streets. Look at all the snow. All right, first stop, Nordstrom Rack. I'm so obsessed with Nordstrom Rack. Probably gonna find shoes and buy them all. These are so cute. Thirty bucks. Nordstrom Rack was a bust. Let's go to Off Broadway. Off Broadway had shoes, but nothing that I wanted. Everything was like sixty dollars. Not a good deal for me. So now here at Target, and I'm gonna go get some Starbucks. Because I have a gift card. We have Starbucks and we're gonna look around Target and see what's new. Because I come here like once a week to shop for things. And I guys, I think I told you guys about the Target Circle app where you get like 1% back. And you can use it on Starbucks inside Target One. This is cute, right? It's like eight bucks at Target. I tried on this one, that's a no. But I think this is really cute. Ignore my shoes. I couldn't do it. I couldn't spend the money. I put everything back that I found. I just, I didn't need it. This is just so pretty out here. I did not film eating with my friend. I really just wanted to enjoy time with her, but we went to the Cork and Rye. It was cute, it was fun. 
We had beer and we ate some taquitos. 4.21 a.m. and I am ready to go to work. I just need to put on my lipstick, brush my teeth, and then change really quick. Three legs today. I have about 25 minutes, so I need to be downstairs. I need to pack up my stuff probably make some coffee and then go get ice for my meal prep. I am all checked. My medical equipment, emergency equipment is good. My jumpsuit over here. I cleaned it because 2020 self care. So I put on gloves now to check all my equipment clean everything I touch with a Clorox wipe so at least I can kill 99.9% of the germs. We have about 50 open seats on this flight and there's pretty bad weather in Buffalo so I don't know how that's going to turn out for when we do our Buffalo turn. Our other three crew members are getting on right now so that means we're going to board soon. I just love when we duct tape seats at 5 o'clock in the morning. Look at that. Well, Look at up. that wad. Love that for us. Right, so we're in Buffalo. It's been a very busy day. Very tired. We have one flight left. There's a lot of kids. Adults are not nice. Kids are nicer than adults. We also trashed our plane on both legs. We're home! We officially made it to Orlando. It's currently 6.17. Traffic was not terrible um it did take about 45 minutes to get here and normally coming home that's pretty good for five o'clock in my opinion so i'm gonna take all my junk inside and then i have a package to open let's see what is inside our package i placed an order on sephora so the first thing i ordered was a repair kit from Dr. Jart. So this is the Soothe Repair Strengthen Sensitive Dry Skin, because I have dry skin now that I'm flying. I used to be like the oiliest person in the world. I bought the Belief Mini Set. And in this, it has the Aqua Bomb Jelly Cleanser, the Hydrating Water Essence, I've had this stuff before and I really like it, so I repurchased it. Dermalogica Power Cleanse Duo for my layovers because I am out of this stuff or just out of face wash because I left mine in Raleigh. Primera Cream, which is a hydrator and illuminator and it's water cream. I love water creams. That's everything that I got at Sephora. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this adventure with me. I made a bagel. It's really hot and it's right here. I'm gonna clean all this up, gonna unpack, eat my bagel, take a shower, and hang out. It's Wednesday, Casey plays in Tampa tonight. He'll be home later. Um, not a very exciting adventure, but I was happy to see my friends. Sorry, didn't film any of it. Wanted to focus on us, but like I said, Thanks for watching, coming along on this adventure with me, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Good night.